They say knowledge and power na five and six, just like Unikman and Pangroove. But we are not there today. Guess where we are at? We are in Egbeda. Let us go. What's your name? Uh, Mr. Toby. Mr. Toby, you stand a chance to win 10,000 if you answer five of my questions correctly. You can only cash out after your second question. Pick a number from number one to 20. Number one to 20? Mm. One to 20, one to 20, one to 20. Number five. Number five. All right, let's see what I have in number five. Number five says, reggae music originated in which country? Reggae music originated uh, Jamaica. Jamaica. Are you sure? Yes. Jamaica is your final answer? Yes. You think reggae originated from Jamaica? Yes. Ladies and gentlemen, he just got himself 1,000 Naira. <laughs> I see. I see you have quite a lot of family members here. Don't disgrace them. No, no. Hey, hey. For your second question, okay. we gives you 3,000 Naira. Remember, after now you can cash out, all right? If you get it correctly. For your second question, which gives you 3,000 Naira, pick another number. Number eight. Number eight, Casablanca. Is a city located in which continent? Hey. Again, the question. Casablanca is a city located in which continent? Casablanca. Casablanca. Ha! Ah. Baba Jehovah. Casablanca. Located in which, uh, which continent? Continent. Mm. Wait. Hold on, wait. No, I did with you. I did with you. Europe. Asia. North America. Which continent is it? You don't call the whole continent now. Which I don't call the whole continent now. Yeah, which continent? You know, it, it depends on the names. The names. So I want to know the kind of names. Uh, Where Casablanca? Uh, uh, Zimbabwe. Casablanca. Mm, Cas Africa. 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 You sure? Where to make it say Casablanca? The Africa. You know, there's nothing in Europe. I haven't heard that name before in, in Europe. Europe. Yes. We have heard and it in Africa. It, mm, yes, I've heard it in Africa, but it's within East Africa. It's within Africa? Yes. Are you sure? Oh. Are you just placing a guess? I'm making a guess on it. But... All right, ladies and gentlemen, he just got himself 3,000 naira. <laughs> oh my God. <laughs> Come on, I mean, you can't I, I did. Hold on, hey. Come on, hey. I got no book. <laughs> No, my man, that was quite, I mean, really, that, that was, I see, I, I mean, I see what you did there, I see how you took your time, you took your time to, uh, to get it correctly, yeah. In China, there's no Casablanca in there, because I've been, yeah, I've been watching China movie, he said, you're chief, you know, you don't want to talk to you, because you're not, you're not, Japan, you know, say, Japan will feel get closer to it. Oh, yeah, I mean, well done, so you have 3,000 Naira now, all right? Your next question will give you 5,000 Naira. Do you want to cash out 3,000 Naira now or try playing for 5,000 Naira? Remember, if you fail the next question, all the money you've acquired is gone. You go money, daddy. I beg. Make it to okay. Are you sure? All right, come now, come now. Come. Make it to okay. Make it to okay. Make it to okay. Ladies and gentlemen, he has chosen to cash out. 3,000 Naira. Thank Cashing you. out 3,000 Naira. That last song, last song. Mm -hmm. See my people, yeah. Yeah, so you, you, know you made Lagos State proud. Thank right? you. Who am I with? Samuel. Samuel, Samuel, don't move away from me now. Let the fine people watching me see your fine face, eh? Samuel, you stand a chance to win 10,000 Naira if you answer five of my questions correctly. Pick a number from number one to 20. Mm. Six. Six. Who was the first Nigerian woman to drive from London to Lagos. Shit, 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 shit. Look at me, man. Look at me. Yeah. What happened? All of a sudden, you are running away. Don't run away, don't run away. Face from the lawyer to Lagos. Yeah. Don't run away from me. Yes. From Lyra, some Kuti. From Lyra, some Kuti. Drove from London to Lagos. Is that your final answer? Yeah, I don't have a choice, yes. You don't have a choice. Are you sure? From Lyra, some Kuti is your final answer. She drove all the way from London to Lagos. It's wrong. You think so? What if you're right? You're like giving up already. No, no, no. I know it's wrong, but I chose her. Oh, you know it's wrong, but you chose her. Paul Naira Samkuti was the first woman to drive a car in Nigeria, but not the first woman to drive from London to Lagos. The answer is Pelumi Nubi. Thanks for playing. <laughs> What's your name? Hope. Hope. Pick a number from number one to 20. 
Okay, 15. 15. Okay, 15 says, what is a single strand of spaghetti called? Oh, okay, um, spaghetti. Spag like one strand, if you take one, only one spaghetti. That one strand, what's in the color? Hey. Uh, <laughs> if you just pick only one, just like this. Spark. That one, that one, that only one. What's in the color? Spark. Mm. If you take one, what's in the color? Spark. Ichoke. Ichoke. Uh, in the color of Ichoke? I don't know. <laughs> Is it your final answer? You know, no. Hey, come now, no worry, no worry. That's the idea of playing. You understand me? It's okay if you don't know. You understand me? Nobody dare to laugh you. We dare to just learn. Miss if I did learn today. You understand me? So the correct answer is spaghetto. Spaghetto? Yeah, spaghetto. <laughs> You're still live in Egbeda and I am here with Bamdili Abiodun. Pick a number from number one to twenty. Let me pick uh, number nineteen. Number nineteen says which states in Nigeria has the largest local government areas? Largest local government area? Yeah. I think it's Lagos. It's Lagos? You sure? Or you're just guessing? Lagos, I think it's Lagos. You think it's Lagos? I think it's Lagos. Hmm. So Lagos is the final answer? Final. Ah. <sighs> Almost everybody will assume Lagos, but unfortunately, Lagos is actually the wrong answer. The state with the largest local government area is Kano State with 44 local government areas. Kano. All right? Thanks for playing, huh? All right, we learn every day. What's your name, sir? My name is Ghazali Wasiu. Ghazali Wasiu, you stand a chance to win 10,000 Naira if you answer five of my questions correctly. You want to give it a try? Yes, sir. You sure? Yes. Say it like you mean it. A minute. All right, that's good. All right, I'll pick uh, from number one to twenty. Pick a number. One to what? twenty. One to twenty. Mm -hmm. Give me number one. Number one. Number one says, "Who wrote the novel, Purple Hibiscus?" The novel Purple Hibiscus. Mhm. Mm auction, my auction. Option. Option. Yes. No option, sir. No option at all. Purple Hibiscus. Purple Hibiscus. I don't know it. No idea. No idea. So let's say it's game over for you. Okay. But I will not let you go without giving you knowledge, all right? Okay. That's what we're doing. Not only playing, but sharing knowledge. The person who wrote the novel, Purple Hibiscus, is Chimamanda Adichie. We are still live in Egbeda, and I am here with somebody who says, I know you. I've been watching you on Street Squeeze. All right, I caught her today and I'm going to ask her a question. What's your name? Joy Mackinday. Joy Mackinday. Okay, today you're going to be on the other side of the screen, all right? Pick a number from number one to twenty. Number nine. Number nine. Okay, number nine. Number nine says, "Who is the current director general of the World Trade Organization?" You don't know. Uh uh, you know. I don't know. You actually know. <laughs> actually don't. If I tell you the answer, you say, "Oh my God, I can't believe it's her." I actually don't know. You don't know. You have no idea, right? World Trade Organization. Anyway, it's fine if you don't know. Yeah. But that's why we are going. Uh, the current director general of the World Trade Organization. No, no, no. I want to be sure of the, what I'm... Okay, yeah. That That's a smart word. From my head, her name yes. is Ngozi Okonjo Iwala. Oh, my goodness. Oh, my goodness. All right? right? Yeah. It's yeah. good having you on the show. Thanks for playing. All right. Thank you. All right. Now, I mean, I'm not a robot as well. <laughs> my name is Stanley Okeke, and guess who I am with? Blessing Promise. Blessing Promise. Uh, Pick a number from number 1 to 20. Uh, 20. 20 says, what was the Roman numeral? X stand for? X stands 10. 10? Are you sure? Five. Roman numeral 10. X. X. That's your final answer. Yeah, yeah. Ladies and gentlemen, Blessing has promised to take all my money. She has started with 1,000 Naira and 1,000 Naira is hers. Here, Blessing. Here, 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 here. Here, here, here. You have 1,000 Naira in your pocket right now. For 3,000 Naira, pick another number. Uh, 18. 18. All right, let's see what I have in 18. What is the medical term for difficulty falling or staying asleep? Medical term, how? Yeah, like, for someone who is having difficulties with sleeping. I don't know. You don't know? Are you sure? Think it through, you know it. Trust me. Take your time. I don't know. You don't know? Yeah, yeah. All right, it's okay. Blessing promise. The game ends here for you. 
But I'll tell you the answer. Insomnia. Insomnia, okay. Yeah, it's called I insomnia. Hello, do you mind? The answer five of my questions currently, you win 10k. They're very easy questions. You want to give it a try? Yes, if you answer five of my questions currently, you win 10k. You want to give it a try? Let's give it a try now. Let's try. Don't worry, you just might be lucky. Let's face it. Don't worry, it won't take much of your time. You can use my money to buy corn if you win it. No, without your money, I can actually buy corn. Of course, you can even buy all of us, Seth. Of course. If possible. Okay, you buy me one corn today. You know what I'm like, hey, she's promising me one con, but answer my questions first, real quick. We are still live in Egbeda, and I am here with... Catherine. Catherine, you stand a chance to win 10,000 naira if you answer five of my questions correctly. You cannot skip or fail to answer any of my questions. Yeah. If you do that, it's game over for you, and all the money you've acquired is gone. But you can cash out after answering your second one correctly. And I pray you cash out today. Okay. Like, I pray you win all my money. Okay. So you can buy me more con. Even more than one. Mm. All right, let's give it a try. Pick a number from number 1 to 20. Number 10. 10. 10 says, which country hosted the 2024 Olympics? Mm. Is this year? You never tell which country who's that Olympics where so they just finish. No, 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 no. Um. You never tell. Now this year, Catherine, you know it, you know it. They just finish and you never tell. Mm. Mm. No audience. No audience? Yeah. Or no idea? No idea. No idea? Yes. Are you sure? Uh uh, Catherine, you did not think it did not think about it. Hmm. Egypt. 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 Are you sure? Yes. Is that a final answer? Yes. Egypt. Why did you say Egypt? Yes, it's Egypt. It's Egypt. Egypt, final answer. Yes. Anyway, this one does not stop you from buying me my corn. No. It's game over for you anyway. No. But my con is still intact. Yes. But I'll tell you the answer anyway. The answer is France. Wow, wow. Wow. Yes. All right. Thank you very much for playing. It was nice having you on the show. High five. Oh, yeah, my con. <laughs> oh. My con. Guess what? On the streets, I got a con. All right. I got a con from Catherine. Emilio con. Let me eat my con. Because Emilio con. <laughs> Thank you. All right, gracias. All right, we're still live in Egbeda, and I am here with... Richard. Richard! Are you ready to play? Let's try. From number 1 to 20, pick a number. Uh, 12, 12. 12, okay. 12 says, what term is used to describe a group of witches? Coven. Coven? Is that your final answer? Yes, Coven. I'm guessing you've gone to meetings like that and you understand how it works. That's why you just said it, Kovun. Kovun is correct. Give me a high five, bro. You just want to say 1,000 <laughs> Yeah, yeah, yeah. I know, I know you're a child of God. <laughs> Scratch that part. <laughs> Editor, don't put that part to This guy is a man of God. Anyway, you have 1,000 naira in your pocket right now. For 3,000 naira, pick another number. 12. 12. 12. First one was 11, right? Yeah, no, no, first one was 12. 12. Okay, 11 now. 11. All right, let's go. 11 says, Topo Island is located in which Nigerian state? <laughs> Topo Island. Yes. Nigeria Island. Topo said. Island. Does Nigeria have an island? Um, Topo Island. I'm not sure Nigeria has an island. Uh -huh. Look at that, it's not an island. Topo uh -huh. Island, Topo Island. I, I, don't have, I don't have idea. I don't have idea. No idea. Are you sure? No, no. Topo Island. I don't have idea. So no idea. The correct answer is Lagos State. Topo Island is in Badagri, somewhere around that area. All right. All right. Uh, can we can't try again now. Mm, it's game over for you. <laughs> <laughs> All right. so what's your name? Priscilla. So pick a number from number one to twenty. Three. Three. What is the full meaning of KFC? Ah, I don't know. KFC. Mhm. Mm Ah, no, 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 no. I don't know. You know it now, Priscilla. I don't no, know now. You know it now. I only know what they sell. I don't know. You only know what they sell. <laughs> what did they sell? Ah, chicken. Chicken, now. right? Yeah. So that's the last word in KFC. So guess the last, the first two. Maybe the F is. Ah? No, 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 no. One. No idea. Mm -mm. I don't know. You don't know? You are the first person I gave a clue in this show. I gave you a full clue of chicken. You got the last hey, I know one. that one already now. Uh, 
This layer was nice having you on the game show, but I'll tell you the answer, all right? The meaning of KFC is Kentucky Fried Chicken. Wow, wow right? <laughs> uh, good. Uh, good. Are you ready to play? Yeah, yeah. All right, pick a number from number one to 20. Four. Four it is. So let's see what I have in four. Four says, what animal changes color to match its surroundings? Chameleon. Chameleon. Yeah. So you think chameleon is the correct answer? Yeah, chameleon is actually the correct answer. I like the way you're saying your full courage. Chameleon is the correct answer. Chameleon. That's the correct answer. That's the correct answer. And because you're correct, you're not giving me that. Anyway, high five, high five. You have 1,000 naira in your pocket right now. All right. So for 3,000 naira now, pick another question. 17. 17. 17 says, how many strings does a standard violin have? Ah. Oh. Yeah, you have 50 cent now. You should know this one now. It's music. How many strings does a standard violin have? I think seven or so. Seven I'm strings? Sure. Come on now. I'm not really the music person. Yeah, but you you have 50 cents, you know. Come on. I'm not, I'm not sure. Not sure? Are you sure? Yeah. Try and I'll give it a try. Probably seven. Seven strings. A violin. Five. Five. Five? That's for a guitar. It's five, your final answer. Five. Five. Five it is. So five, her final answer is wrong. The correct answer to that is four. It was nice having you on the game show. Yeah. Come and stand here. No worry. Miss no Sabibu. All of us, they learn together, all right? I'm live here with um, Rafi Waris. Are you ready to play? Yes, I'm ready. All right, Rafi. You say it like you mean it. I'm ready. Say I'm ready. I'm ready. I'm a boss, my man. So pick a number from number one to 20. OK, give me number 13. Number 13. Okay, let's see what I have in 13. 13 says, what is the full meaning of PM in time notation? PM. Yeah. Like you say 8 PM. You understand? What's the meaning of PM in time notation? PM. Um, let's say... Yeah. Is it not past minutes? No, no. Past minutes? No, I don't think so. Let me just, let me just say past minutes. I, I can't really. Past minutes? Yeah, let me just say, give so it a try. Let's say time is eight past minutes. Is that the meaning of PM? Ah. Eight past minutes? Um, okay, Um. eight PM means like, okay, let me say eight past noon. No, M, no, it's N, that is 8 p.m. Mm -hmm. I, I can't. I can't. It's okay, it's okay. That's the idea of playing, all right? We are going around not only sharing money, but also we are yeah, sharing I, knowledge. Uh, yeah, that's true. Yeah, yeah. So it's okay not to know, all right? Thanks for playing. It's game over for you, but I'll tell you the answer, all right? The correct answer to that is post meridian, or you say after midday. Okay, after midday. Yeah, post meridian. There are some questions people will not know, but due to what you ask now, I would like to know the answer, but now you told me. I cannot forget that. Thank that you. I'm, Thank you. I'm glad. You my spirit, guys. I'm glad to be with you. Ah, I'm glad to have you on the show, too. Thank you. Let me tell you, you're an inspiration to many watching right now. No, it's fine. Many people, if I meet them on the radio, say, no, 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 no. But guess what? We taught them something today. Yeah, that's Okay, the idea of playing is also to learn. Everything is not by making money, but it's just by learning. Mm. Don't, don't just think that uh, money is everything, mm. because you can gain knowledge anywhere. Just... Like you got from me today. Yeah. Thank you so much. Yeah. That's quite inspiring. No, thank you. Thank you so much. And actually, we have come to the end of today's episode. Don't forget to like, share, subscribe, and continue to follow all our content. Boom.